guys thank you for tapping in with me again today and if you're new to the channel i'm cleveland so check it out we have some things we gotta do today it's late it finally cooled off enough for me to get in the garage and do some work so i have a lot of videos to put out i have a lot of things to do but we're going to start with moving all the fish in all three of these aquariums and these two 125s and from that 150 into the 240 right behind you yes you heard me correct all of these fish are going into that 240 right there so that's going to leave three aquariums open two 125s and a 150 gallon aquarium i'm not going to tell you what i'm going to do with it you're going to have to catch that in the next video but in this video we taking these fish out we add them into that aquarium so let's do that first all right so let's start off with this aquarium right here I know water is looking green it's not it's just a whole lot of algae on the glass I need to take care of that let's wipe that off first before we catch the fish or should we just catch the fish we really don't care about the algae let's just catch the fish so these guys all right so these guys think they're gonna eat oh no 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 they're about to get caught <laughs> they're not about to eat I'm about to catch them who will I catch first? Will it be the bass? It's not going to be the bass. It might be the bass. He's kind of big. Let's go ahead and make, make this work. We will make it work. Get, come here. Got you. Got the bass. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Got the bass. The bass goes in at 240. Boom. There you go. Look at him. All right, he looking mad. Sorry, right. he'll adjust. Next up. Let's go. Come on, y'all getting upgraded. Let's go. I need my ladder. That's what I need. All right. So now let me go ahead and move. Let's wipe. Ah, I can't even get that off. Yeah. All right. So I got this moved out the way now. Next up, we got a snook. We got a snook. Oh, we had a snook. Come on, we got you. All right, like I said, we got a snook on our hands. There we go. We got the snook. Come on. There you go. There's a snook right there. The bass over here in the corner looking mad. Let's get that red out of bat pole right there. Let's get that red out of bat pole right there yeah buddy you next yeah boy yeah boy yeah boy yeah boy yeah boy oh you got away all right i see all right you know what we're just gonna have to just take this rock out cuz you keep going around that one come on let's go let's go let's go let's go come on let's go come on let's go let's go 
Let's go. Let's go. Where you at? Come on. Man. Time to go. Let's go. He ain't trying to go. <laughs> he ain't trying to. Come on. Where are you at? There we go. Come on. Shake and bake. Shake and bake. Mm. Shake and bake. Ah. Woo. Tied up in the line, huh? Right when I was about to get him, still got him. Got it, finally. Man. Woo. Yeah, he, uh, he wasn't feeling it. There you go. There we go. Y'all in here together, man. Calm down. Stop stressing out. Bass up here, stressed. It's time to get the arowana. All right, so now it's time to get this arowana. I'm, I'm gonna get to pick this catfish too, but I gotta be careful with those because uh, they'll get stuck in the net. I'll end up having to cut my net. Like I always have to do. We're not doing that this time. All right. Let's go ahead and get this arowana up out of here. That was easy. Oh. Almost lost him. Almost lost him. All right. And in goes the arowana. Beautiful. So the only, only one that's acting all stressed out is the bass over there. He'll get it together. Let's get those pick this catfish in here. And let's get the rest of the guys. All right, so I had to make some room in order for me to get this big old piece of driftwood out. Because there's no way I could catch them without removing this. They're just too crafty. Too small too fast oh that's a heavy piece of driftwood <clears throat> say what okay babe love you Alright, so now let me grab this, this big piece of lava rock. I need to make all the room I can. Put the time in. I'll set that right up in here. 
and this bottom tank. <sighs> All right, let's get this last one out the way. No more hiding spots. Bet you're wondering what, what I'm going to do with all these empty aquariums, huh? I'll be wondering the same thing. Got some big empty aquariums. Well, some of y'all know. That's for sure. All right. So let's, uh, we got two over there. One right there. And like I said, they could easily get stuck in my net. So I'm not using just the net. I'm gonna pull them out, I'm gonna grab them with the net. I'm gonna grab them with the net. I'm gonna put them inside of a container and then we'll take them out. Oh, still is recording, damn. All right, so let's check it out. This is what I'm going to use right here. Let's get you closer. All right, so. We got two over there, could you see? We got two back there, and we got one right here. Let's go ahead and, uh, and catch them. Ooh, thought it was gonna be quick. I was about to be happy. Let's get this out the way. This is not going to be easy, I'll tell you that. Just as I caught two. Come on now. Got both of y'all. All right. So now, like I said, you got, see, I got them. I should go down there and get that third one too. See how I got both of them right there? So I'm going to fish them out. So he's already trying to get caught in that net. Watch what I do. Watch what I do. See? Messed it up. It's all good. Now that I got them in there, I need to get them in there. See that? See how I did that? Just like that. So we won't be losing any more now that you've seen how I do it. Now you just got to watch me do it. Oh, lost him. <laughs> Got him. Boom. So, let's go ahead and just share. Uh, just like that. <clears throat> Another one. Just like that. Safest way. No harm, no foul. Right in the tank. Last one. Come on. Let's go. Let's get you on up out of there. Get you back with your 
Get you back with your friends. All right, there we go. Yep, there we go again. Last one. So like I said, you could do it multiple ways. That's how I do it. Just learn after cutting some nets. We don't want to cut no more nets. All right. Bass is still over there in the corner. The bass is still over there in the corner, but he'll be all right. Got this tank left. Sun cats, Dovi. Maybe I'll wait on them. I'll wait on them. Let's let these guys get acclimated. So we'll hold off on this tank right here. Got this one empty. This one empty. We got two little fish down there. Maybe I'll move all the fish into this one. This one looks better than this one up here. I don't know. What you think? Anyway, I'll figure it out. But yeah, so let's take a look. All right, so I put that big piece of driftwood in there. Didn't record that part. But I also will put this piece of lava rock in here. Just until I figure out what the setup is going to look like. I do plan on, believe it or not, I'm actually going to remove that 75 gallon up there. I'm probably going to move the turtles out of here and put them into a different aquarium. Eventually, I want to set up a pond for them. So just getting them up out of there. You know what I mean? I want to have it open again. You know what I mean? I really want to have it open again where I could access it better, have this side lighted, being able to escape it the way I want to escape it. So that's the plan. I also have the fx6 that i'm going to put back on here you know just some things i got to do to it but let's take a look at these fish and let's wrap up this video So that about wraps it up for another video. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope that you learned something. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Follow me on Instagram at The Fish Corner. Follow me on Facebook, The Fish Corner. Follow me on TikTok, The Fish Corner. And uh, for those of y'all that really rock with me, I'm going to catch you in the next video. That's about to start immediately after this. So I'm going to catch you in the next one. Peace.